And we're back with another episode of Portal 2 with Infinite Spiral. Thank you. I can't believe I'm thanking these people. <laughs> For staggering your way through Aperture Science's propulsion gel testing, you've made some real contributions to society for a change, and for that, humanity is grateful. If you had any belongings, please pick them up now. We don't want old newspapers and sticks cluttering up the building. For many of you, I realize $60 is an unprecedented windfall, so don't go spending it all on, I don't know, Carolyn, what do these people buy? Tattered hats? Beard dirt? <laughs> uh, beard dirt. I'm gonna spend 60 bucks on some beard dirt. Fucking fantastic. Man, that was way faster than the previous uh, gel experiments. I guess... They recognize that gel that makes you go fast is not nearly as complicated as gel that makes you bounce, or something. Some such. Can I go in here? No, I can't. I can't help but explore. It's just my way. So let's see what's going on up here. Ah. Pump station gamma. Okay then. Let's get to it. There. Well, it's uh, oh, simple enough. I want top floor or second floor. Yeah, let's go down there first. Let's see what's going on. Okay. And what's. Hey. Eh? Just not allowed to see that. Okay. Cool. Now let's see what's going on up here. Carolyn, 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 why do I know this woman? Did I kill her? Or. Oh my god. Look, oh, you're figuring it out, are you? Doing a great job. Can you handle things for yourself for a while? I need to think. Uh, it doesn't seem that complicated to me. I think you know the answer already. Or maybe you're just in denial. But, I guess we can't force things on her. I guess we have to go in there. We'll deal with that slanted surface in a moment. Let's see what's through here. Yeah, the pump station, of course. Well, let's not go down there. That would be a waste of time. We all know how much I love time wasting. Yes. Yes, indeed. Those pumps going? Oh fuck! Really? That's unnecessary. Oh, Look, some leakage going on here. But that is our third type of gel: the white shit, portable surfaces, wherever I want them, or at least you know wherever I can put goo. Oh, but I can't pour the blue shit, of course. Hmm. Let's just bounce our way over there. And here we are. And some orange shit. I guess there was another leak up here that I didn't see. I, mean, I can see that you want me to run through there, but not really seeing the benefit. I guess I'll do it. Ah, that's the benefit. To open this door. <laughs> <laughs> I guess AIs just can't stand birds in general. It's understandable. Birds kind of suck. I kind of hate them a lot. But that's mostly because they've woken me up way too many times. Or caused Welcome me to be to unable to fall center. asleep in the first place. <coughs> <coughs> Since making test cave. participation mandatory for all employees, the quality of our test subjects has risen dramatically. Employee retention, however, has not. <coughs> As a result, you may have heard we're going to phase out human testing. There's okay. still a few things left to wrap up, though. Now, the bean counters told me we literally could not afford to buy $7 worth of moon rocks, much less $70 million. Bought them anyway. Ground them up, mix them into a gel. And guess what? Ground up moon rocks are pure poison. I am deathly ill. 
Still, it turns out they're a great portal conductor. So now, we're gonna see if jumping in and out of these new portals can somehow leach the lunar poison out of a man's bloodstream. When life gives you lemons, make lemonade. <coughs> Let's all stay positive and do some science. Well, that said, just... I would really appreciate it if you could test as fast as possible. Carolyn, please bring me more pain pills. Poor guy. But why wouldn't he just disassemble himself entirely and put himself back together without the poison? I mean... Well, clearly they're capable of doing that kind of thing. Seems like the best course of action to me. Well, I'm sure he thought of that. I'm sure he's got perfectly good reasons for not engaging in his own science. Poor Cape Johnson. If he hadn't been poisoned by the moon rocks, I bet none of this ever would have happened. With Gladys and her destructive ways, and Wheatley and his stupidity. Of course, then we would have never had this wonderful game. So, I guess I can't complain. It was a necessary sacrifice. Sorry, Cave, you had to go. It was the only way. Alright, let's just spray this white goo all over the place. I'm sure there's some kind of joke to be had there, but as I've already said, I am not a comedian. I'm not going to try and make jokes about shit. Not unless it comes on me. I mean, comes into me. I mean, comes in me. I mean, come... Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm sure this is just fascinating. I can't help myself. I always want to cover every surface. It's disgusting. It's an obsession. Where the fuck am I supposed to be going from here anyway? Yeah, I know I can spray this shit everywhere, but... Clearly there's places that it needs to go. I guess let's go over here. Yeah! Now we're in another place. Spray some more of that shit out of here. And maybe figure out where it needs to be going. That looks like a likely candidate. Mm hmm. Okay. Now we got a nice slanty surface there. Get this wall nice and set up. I guess, really, we have. All sorts of things at our disposal, there's probably more than one way to actually get through this. But... I'm thinking it's going to be a way that involves a long fall... ...into a portal, and out through the slanted surface to get up there. So... Let's just do that. Gives you lemons. Don't make lemonade. Yeah. Make life take the lemons back. Yeah. Get mad. Yeah. I don't want your damn lemons. What am I supposed to do with these? Yeah, take the lemons. Demand to see life's manager. Yeah. Make life rule the day and thought it could give Cave Johnson lemons. Do you know who I am? I'm the man who's gonna burn your house down with the lemon. Oh, like I'm gonna get my engineers <laughs> to invent a combustible lemon that burns your house down. <laughs> Point is, <laughs> if we can store does, music Gladys. on a compact disc, why can't we store a man's intelligence and personality on one? So I have the engineers figuring that out now. Brain mapping, artificial intelligence. We should have been working on it 30 years ago. But I will say this, and I'm going to say it on tape so everybody hears it a hundred times a day. If I die before you people can pour me into a computer, I want Carolyn to run this place. <laughs> Now she'll argue. She'll say she can't. She's modest like that, but you make her. <coughs> Hell, put her in my computer. I don't care. All right, test's over. <coughs> you can head on back to your desk. Goodbye, sir. 
Well, I think our mystery's been solved then, hasn't it? <clears throat> Cave Johnson died with a partial robot. And, uh, oops. Still not quite finished here. Gotta fix that bit of floor. Yeah, died with a partially built robot. And Carolyn took over. And apparently they shoved her into his robot and out came Gladys. And the rest, as they say, is history. Alright, now let's fucking make this work. Kinda pissing me off that it's not. God damn it! <laughs> Alright, yeah, that's, that's doing absolutely no good. Unless I can actually manage to... Uh... Yeah, that's... that's... A bad prospect. Oh! Well, that's a much taller tower. But, again... I need to be able to shoot this slanted surface. That's difficult to do. Fuck it. Fuck the difficulty. We'll do it. I'm gonna make life take those lemon. Ah, shit, I almost had it. <laughs> I'm gonna make life take the lemons back. That's what I was trying to say. Let's do it. Fuck the lemons. Failing miserably. For fuck's sake. Well, maybe we need to be trying a different approach, because we're not having much success. I guess we can come over here, spray some goo on these towers, maybe that'll get some better results. Go we'll explore some newer, different places, get a different angle on things. So it sort of looks like a place that I could do something up there, from that platform. Yes. I think that might be the way. Let's just spray our way back and forth up these towers. Yeah, that seems to be working quite well. Alright. Let's get the fuck up there. Hey, blue portal. Please, thank you. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> Just trying to step out onto the ledge. And it doesn't want to let me. There. Excellent. Just like we always wanted. Now, we've got the height. And we've got the slanted surface. Let's fucking do this. No more fucking around. Holy shit. Maybe there really was only one way to get up here. Maybe I was wrong about that bunch of different ways thing. Whoa. Okay, nothing going on in here. And all the background noise just cut out. It's interesting. But I think that's more than enough for one day. So, thanks for watching. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.